Hello, it's Marion Stewart and I'm talking about menopause today, particularly on this hot day when the sun is shining and normally we'd absolutely love the sunshine but it's not so great when you're going through the menopause because it makes you even more hot and bothered than normal. Um, I've been helping women, as many of you know, for many, many years to get them through menopause without having to use drugs and hormones, using a program that's very science-based and everything that I recommend has been through some kind of clinical trial, been shown to be safe and effective. And I've helped literally tens of thousands of women over the years with my program and very often used to work on exclusively on a one-to-one -one basis and write lots of different books on the subject of women's health. But a few years ago, I started to look at how I could help groups of women going through the menopause. I was in a situation where I'd been out of the industry for a while, I was running a campaign in memory of my daughter on legal highs and I'd been out for six and a half years. Before that I'd had my own TV show and I had a column in the Daily Mail and various magazines and when I came back I was really looking at starting all over again and wondering where I could be most useful. And I decided when I looked around at what was going on that in 1990 when I started helping women going through the menopause there was very little help, very little information coming from GP surgeries except for on hormone replacement therapy and tranquilizers. And still when I looked into, at the end of 2016 there was nothing much for women. They were still in the same situation. And we know that most women are going to have some problems at the time of the menopause. Some of them get off quite lightly. Others feel really terrible. And when I say terrible, I often encounter women who are feeling suicidal and they feel literally that it's the end of life as they knew it. And it shouldn't be that way. Certainly from my perspective, I know that over 90% of women are symptom free within five months of going through my program. And that's been happening year on and year just for so many times and I'm, I'm so used to seeing that happen I just get so frustrated when I see women who are suffering in a serious way and recently we've been doing series of surveys we've looked at how relationships are damaged by menopause very often women can't have a physical relationship with their partner they feel like they've been switched off from the waist downwards they lose their self-esteem they're not functioning very well in the workplace. Very often over 80% of the women in our survey on the workplace said that they weren't being productive for at least a week a month because they had brain fog. And just so many women having panic attacks, palpitations, feeling achy, feeling tired, and all sorts of things that you wouldn't automatically associate with menopause. So at the end of 2016, I met up with someone who taught me how to start a Facebook group, how to make Facebook Live films, because although I've made lots of films in my career, I've never really made a film where I was actually in charge of the camera. And that was a bit scary to me because I'm not very technical at all. But I found I could do this, and I'd always had a goal to set up a community for women to help them and enlighten them and give them better information. And so there I was that day on this course, and I was able to do both, to actually learn how to make a film and set up this Facebook group. And it, works re it worked really well, except I was then literally inundated because within three months of making those first little Facebook films, over a million women saw them. And I was literally inundated by suffering and women telling me the most awful tales that very often made me feel very tearful. So I set up the group and I've been trying to help women on a self-help basis in my natural menopause group give out lots of information, I make weekly wisdom films every week, I have a newsletter, I try and go and answer questions. But last summer there was a bit of a, a revolt in the group, if you like, in that women were saying that they felt that they needed more help. So I eventually put together a boot camp, a six week boot camp, which has been running very successfully, in fact much more successfully than I ever dreamed it would because I thought it was going to help women to devise their program based on the program that I normally write for people in my clinic. But in fact after five or six weeks a lot of the women are saying that they feel that their whole life has been turned around and they've gone from feeling on the edge and life not being worth living at all 
to feeling that they can embrace life and their relationships again and they're getting their self-esteem back. And that's music to my ears, obviously, even after only a few weeks. So the point in my group is that obviously I have to make a charge for my boot camp and it's out of reach of, of a lot of the women in my group. So recently another focus group told us that we needed to have something that's more affordable. So I went back to the drawing board with my team and we put together a 14-day menopause empowerment program, which is, it's a program for each woman that contains a film every day and some magazine style information. Probably doesn't take more than 10 minutes to absorb it, but I give very specific instructions for women so they can follow them, so that they know exactly what they're supposed to be eating, drinking, what they should be taking out of their diet at this time in their life, what they should be putting in to get naturally occurring estrogen, to make their diets really nutrient dense because we know from our research that very often women have got low levels of important nutrients and that affects your hormones and your brain chemistry as well and stops you feeling normal. So you've got to normalize all of that and maybe make some lifestyle changes too. And very often when you go into the high street shops and you buy a packet of pills, they're not necessarily standardized, they haven't necessarily been through any clinical trials. And what's even more scary is research shows that sometimes they're not, they don't even contain what they say on the label. And that makes me very angry. So I feel that women have a right to sound quality, science-based information so that they can put it to good use at the time of the menopause and perimenopause for that matter because very often in your 40s you start to go through changes and if you learn how to meet your needs you can actually get yourself in the driving seat and you can literally sail through the menopause without falling into that big dark hole. So it's never too early to get yourself sorted out and even if you're past menopause which means your period stopped a year ago or more you've still got to protect yourself from things like heart disease, bone loss, and dementia, which you're much more predisposed to after menopause. So it's really, really important to learn to meet your needs, to get yourself back into good nutritional shape, and to get your nutrients as well as your hormones in an optimum range, and have a good lifestyle so that you're making sure you're not laying down fat around your middle, that you're keeping your shape and you like what you see in the mirror. So I have, I'm inviting you, I've put the link to the 14-day empowerment program, the Menopause Empowerment Program, alongside the film. You're most welcome to go. I calculated when I was getting ready that we spend the national average for coffee and, and for alcohol and chocolate, which we all tend to use as a comfort when we're going through menopause. We're spending on average £35 a week, believe it or not. 1800 pounds a year and those things will make your menopause symptoms worse so I promise you there's some absolutely gorgeous things that you can have instead I go into great detail about that and you can save money as well obviously after it's the equivalent the cost is the equivalent of three weeks of all of that stuff that isn't going to make you feel good and after that you are saving money and feeling so much better the women who've been test driving this for us so far in the last few weeks are saying even in the space of a few weeks it's life-changing it's very easy to do they're absolutely loving it and I'm so thrilled that I finally hit on something that huge numbers of women can take advantage of you can do it in the privacy of your own home it's all virtual and you get a login to go and you get new information every single day for two weeks and at the end of it you'll know exactly what you're supposed to be doing to overcome your menopause symptoms so be my guest help yourself I'd love to hear feedback about how you get on and really look forward to helping you in this very special self-help way thank you for joining me